All right, we are back in Raccoon City in the gun shop here. Um, it's a hell to like figure out how to get this recording again after getting a new display. I don't know what was going on, but apparently it doesn't like recording in 4K on this game. I checked online, there's a bunch of like things on the forum, but anyway, it seems to be recording. Hopefully shit doesn't cut out or crash, but uh, I can edit that out or just have to figure out what to do next, but let's get going. Right, he went in there to see his daughter, and he gave me a key. Right, 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 right. Of course, of course, of course. Ah, you motherfucker. Ah! Fuck off. No! Oh, Jesus, what the fuck? Oh, vagina face. Oh, uh, this is not going well. What the fuck? I don't know if they can go through doors, but... I don't want to waste a bullet, but it's a collectible. Oh, you motherfucker. Oh, Jesus! Motherfucking tentacle piece of shit. I need healing. Uh, well, I'm actually only on caution, so I'll hold off. Uh, apparently I can discard this bad boy. <laughs> I was not expecting all those crazy tentacle heads, but okay. Anything I can use in here? Let's not go out there just yet. Let's... Famous last words, let's check out upstairs. Oh, I hope I have my lockpick. Course not. Do I dare? Do I dare? Uh, maybe not through that way. Maybe I can come back. Where? Where am I on the map here? Uh, well, we'll see. We'll see if I can come back here. I doubt it's crazy important. Jeebus. I have a feeling Nemesis is- yeah. Yeah, it was too open and quiet. Oh, what the fuck is that? Oh, that wasn't a good dodge, lady. Okay, okay, I need- I need... I'm doing fine, doing great. Oh, take out the zombie! Uh, I'm doing some good dodges here. I don't even know where I'm supposed to go. Ooh, okay, yeah, take those bitches out. Ooh. Not a good time to answer your walkie. Jill, you okay? Carlos, that monster's on my ass again. Are you shitting me? I thought you killed it. Me too. Oh, what am 
I supposed to do? Boom! Kick it back. Nice. Is he behind me? Oh, he seemed to have just stopped trailing me. Okay, that's nice of him. What's my health at? Oh, I'm fine. Why am I limping? Stop limping. Holy shit. Is this where I go? Oh, goodness. Where the fuck is the station again? Uh, there it is. There it is. He's gonna drop in. <gasps> Not the toy, uncle. Just got crushed by the toy uncle. <laughs> Maybe I should have just kept running and going to the right, perhaps. That should be an achievement, just dying like that. All right, take two. No! Ugh! Dear God! That did not roll at all realistically. Alright. Ah, uh, you motherfucker. Whoa! Oh, you're in my way, sir. Yeah. Oh, you got a twofer. Ah! Ah, fucking dodge into that one. Ah, that's where I need to go, isn't it? Yep. Oh, shit, son. Uh, health, health, health. Health, health, health. Yes. Carlos. Ah! Cool items. Nope. Carlos, I know we didn't get off to a great start. Thanks for the save. Hey, you saved my ass first. You're a hell of a lot braver than me. Well, what matters is that we can get everyone out of the city now. Yeah, now you'll be safe. What about you? Not from the sound of it. 
and I won't be catching the train. Why not? No, there'll be new orders. If it means I can help save the city, it's fine by me. God, the mouth capture is atrocious. I mean, it's better in the videos, they just didn't do it for this in-game talking. Alright, now what, boys? Good work! Your reputation is well deserved. Get inside, the subway's about to leave. Carlos, Tyrell, you have your orders. You need to go back out into the city and find Nathaniel Bart. This isn't the last ride out of town, right? Do not worry. Once the civilians are safe, the train will be back. It's all right, you're going ahead. But I'm not gonna die on you and leave you in a cold, cruel, Carlosless world. Okay. You'll need to find this scientist. His vaccine research could save us all. You see? You're learning. Oh, this garbage man. Any life that matters is your own. Good luck. Let's go! You don't really think a pencil pusher like Barton is still alive, do you? I have a done good authority. Why? Are you worried about teammates? Or something else? Funny how brainless zombies can ambush a platoon like that. Funny the gate was locked. Don't you think? <laughs> <gasps> It was him! What was that? How is this fucker not dead yet? Just no, they're gone. Come, this way. Nikolai, what are you doing? It's not after you. <laughs> Nikolai! <laughs> That's quite a action hero one liner. Oh, it's been a while. Subway's got to be clear of the city by now. Along with your hot date? Nah, but she's not like that. Hell, she's not like anybody. All right. Oh, what? I play as Carlos. This is the police station. Are you sure? It looks like a cemetery to me. It's been a while since I played Nemesis, so I can't even remember how that story plays out. Or if I played as Carlos then. Oh, so, yeah, this should be where Leon was in Resident Evil 2. Hi, Tilly. It's that guy. Sorry. Sorry. Oh, that's how he got hit. Shit, it's locked. You stay on the door. I got this fucker. Come get some. Come on, up. Leave it. Come on. Oh. 
What do you got? The Brad ID card. Do I need that? That could be useful. Ah, here we are. Don't know, don't care. We got a job to do. If our intel's still worth a damn, then Bard's in the star's office. Let's find him and take him into custody. Custody? I thought this was a rescue. <gasps> Carlos. The plans are changing. I've located the star's office. Remember, Bard had access to Umbrella's darkest secrets. He knows we'll try to keep him under our thumbs. So this search and rescue mission is really more like find and detain. Hmm. Right. Good to know. I'll open the shutter so you can get through. You stay here and find out what's been going on here at the station. Call you if I find anything. Hey! Be careful. Yeah. You too, man. All right, so it sounds like he's being screwed by his department. And Nikolai wants to kill everyone but himself and probably works for Umbrella. All right, you want me to keep out? I'll keep out. Oh, hello. Uh, what the fuck? Oh, ID card. Sweet. Glad I killed that guy. ID card security protocols. Each member of the force has been issued an ID card. From now on, the same card will be required to access all storage boxes. Do not lend your card to anyone. Take great care in using it. If your card goes missing, report it lost immediately. Oh, good thing I killed him, not just ran off. All right, so I don't think, oh yeah, because the other police officer, he got bit right then and there, so Leon has not been here yet. This is definitely a prequel. Or prequel time right now. Oh, this is when this guy's face got blasted open. Yeah, there's this dude. And then there's someone hanging here, yep. Well, that brings me back. So, is Nemesis or Liquor? I didn't stick around. Can't see. Oh, you motherfucker! Uh, here we go. Oh. I hit the menu at the perfect time. Uh, whoa, Nelly Bell. Ooh, now it's a wee bit more claustrophobic here. What are? Uh... Oh, there's his friend. There's his friend. Okay, I saw a thing to read there. Okay. Flash grenade. Sweet ass. For some reason, being in these close corners, I'm definitely more stressed out than being out in the city. Now let me in, let me in! T, you copy? There's something real nasty in here. I don't know what it is. Yeah, I don't have those specialty keys. The Tamu locks, perfect. Ah, you motherfuckers! Ooh, headshot! Uh, 
Oh, I'll just let them in. Come on. Ah. Come on. You can make it in here. Come on, buddy. Oh my god, you're such an idiot. There we go. Okay, they all may not be dead, but... Okay. Worth it. Oh wait, I had a knife. God damn it. <laughs> Can't use that. Alright, he's locked in there right now. Is that sweet? Nice. So, how does that help me? Ooh, it just adds a little red thing. Perfect. Oh, God. Stay still. Let me kill you. Fuck's sakes. Yes, needed some more ammo. I don't know if any of these, like, combinations are the same for Resident Evil 2. I don't even remember what the fuck the combos are. Does it say welcome, Leon? Yeah, it does. Uh, arrest report. Unemployed former electrician charges unlawful creation and or possession of explosives. Suspect was seen behaving suspiciously at 1442 Box Street on September 18th, 1998. Suspect's person was searched, producing a small explosive and a time detonator from his inside pocket. Leading to arrest on the charges listed above. A search of suspect's home found more... More than 20 additional homemade explosives at various stages of completion. Suspect was extremely agitated and not of sound mind. Suspect spoke feverishly when questioning began, and at one point questioning had to be halted due to a sudden bout of shrieking from suspect. Once questioning was resumed, suspect made the following statements. I didn't do it for me, I did it for you. Why doesn't anyone understand the corpse's attack from the shadows? A storm's coming, but this umbrella is no good. Gotta blow it up, or you'll be more than just wet. Gotta get more bombs. They're coming soon, gotta hurry. Burn them, burn the corpses. Burn them good. During questioning, the suspect began to shake violently before resuming at a shrieking fit. Questioning was ended, and a sedative administered. Due to suspect's unstable psychiatric condition, suspect's testimony changed from moment to moment. Suspect's delirium made any sort of dialogue impossible. We are currently awaiting the results of a doctor's investigation into suspect's condition. The explosives collected from the suspect's person and residence appear to be extremely powerful. As a safety precaution, a battery was removed from one detonation device upon its admission into evidence. The battery was secured in the safety deposit room. Good to know. You little gargoyle scraps? Do you need to go outside? Hmm? Alright, I think that's everything in here. Nope, guess not. Oh, 
Right, that's where I was earlier. Okay, let's keep keep looking around. I'm pretty sure there's still zombie friend out there. Safety deposit room, that's locked. Came from there. That's blocked off. Is there a door here? No. Uh. Ah, uh, you fuckers. Whoa, you move fast, dude. Fuck, more of you. And if I'm right, this is a save room? Fuck yeah. Needed this. Sweet. Office supply, internal location notice, heat resistant three number combination safe, moved from star's office, second floor to west office. Ooh. Uh, left nine, right 15, left seven. So, nine fifteen seven. Please change the combo ASAP upon receipt. Okay, good to know, good to know. All right, this is the dark room. If cameras killed those things, I'd be set. <laughs> okay. God, so many fucking red herbs, what the hell? Alright, gotta go back to that safe. Oh wait, I just had a fucking trail of zombies behind me. fully out. Uh, what was it again? Nine... Nine, fifteen, seven. Nine... Fifteen... Seven. Ooh, fanny pack. Thank you, much worth it. God, you don't want to give up. So I still need to find a key to that. They're zombies. Save again. Alright, let's make my way upstairs. Baby girl. Oh, for fuck's sake. Why is it blocked? All right, let's check the washroom. Ah, uh, so this is before he blasted through that. Uh. No idea. Oh no, these are oh finally an herb I can combine. Anything else open up? Oh right, that thing. 
Not a note. Note to a friend. Hector, if you're reading this, I'm already dead. If you hear any noises coming from the locker, do not open it, please. While you were out on patrol, I focused on finding a way to get to the other side. I realized that explosives might be our best bet. I managed to rig up a pretty good bomb, but we don't have any batteries for the detonator. I'm pretty sure I sent one to the safety deposit room during intake last week. We need that battery if we're going to knock this wall down, so I headed upstairs to find you since I know you have the safety deposit room key. Well, that's handy. As soon as I left the shower room, I was attacked. One of them bit me. I washed the wound as best I could, but I feel worse and worse. I hope I don't need to spell out why you must not open the locker. Please don't worry about me. Just get yourself out of here as fast as you can. Your buddy, Wes. P.S. Don't worry about that $600 I lent you. <laughs> Think of it as a gift towards your upcoming move. Good luck, buddy. Oh. Alright, I guess I gotta go see his friend. And yeah, the zombie that pops out of the locker is the one that scares you in uh, Resident Evil 2. It's cohesive. Kinda need to replay that now after doing this. Hey, buddy. Okay. Damn it. No. Uh. Oh, I don't even remember seeing you. Oh. oh wait, save your deposit room. That's where I need to go. Alright, you're gonna go for a spin. Something's gonna happen here, isn't it? Now that it knows I have the key. So... But he's got to save. Oh! Stay still. No sounds. Ah! Alright, we got it. What about this fellow? Has he made it down the stairs? Nope. How's my health? Caution. Uh, I should be okay. Such a fancy key. Of course, we got a friend in here. Oop. This looks like a child with an incredibly deep zombie voice. Is he down? Uh, there's a collectible. Alright, I remember this. I needed to find keypad. Wait, how did they restock this for Resident Evil 2 if no one else is alive in here? Oh, you son of a bitch. Uh... Fuck, it's the battery. 104. Just a little battery. There's batteries nowhere else.
Okay. 104, 106, 109. Okay. Oh, wait, I already did that. Yes, thank you. that ooh DCM okay let's get up there then oh Jesus <laughs> let me save first god damn it Seems good, and then I can prep those puppies. All right, now I gotta deal with my leaping friend here. Oh, you're different. You're not the guy I shot earlier. Oh, I'm sorry, bud. Alright, DCM, DCM. Better be worth it. Oh, that's pretty good. Need ammo. Oh god, music's building up for some reason. Something's gonna happen when I... Carlos, I've hit a dead end with the terminal here. Gotta head your way. Copy that. Okay. Oh, right, that's the... <laughs> I've been hitting the long way around. It's just Y to go to my inventory. Alright, so can I use that here? Ah, you son of a gun. Ah, hot water. Jesus! Ah, uh, fuck beans! Uh, of course, uh... Did that just save my life? Wow. Ooh, I got real lucky there. You guys, legs are through the door. Ooh, why is this a video? Dr. Bard. Oh, thank God. Do you know how long I've been trying to reach somebody? Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of there. Just tell me where you are. 
I'm trapped in a goddamn hospital surrounded by every kind of abomination. Look, just send in stars. They're gonna know what to do. Now, negative. RPD's overrun too. Then figure it out! Umbrella's gone crazy. They're killing all the researchers. I am the only one who knows how to make the vaccine to stop the zombies. So you can either sit there with your dick in your hand or send... Send somebody who's capable of getting me the hell out of here. I like him already. Yeah, you would. You heard what he said. We can't turn him over to the company. That's not our call to make. That's Mihail's call. I'm gonna check the computer, see if I can trace the doc's location. He's working against you. Take some time. Look around, see if you can find anything useful. Oh yeah, the armory. Any cool guns? Nope, not in this game. Just... <laughs> just run into all surfaces and try to pick up things. What are you? Report on the mansion incident. The bizarre incident occurred in a mansion owned by the Umbrella Corporation located in the Arclay Mountains. On July 23rd, Star's Bravo team was dispatched to the Arclay Mountains to investigate a series of mysterious and grisly murders and went unexpectedly radio silent. This is explaining Resident Evil 1. On July 24th, Alpha team was dispatched as well and became entangled in the events at the nearby mansion. The incident culminated in the destruction of the mansion, casualties were numerous, the only survivors were five members of Star's. The cause of the incident was the illegal bioweapon experiments being carried out in the secret umbrella lab beneath the mansion. The T-virus being used in these experiments escaped the facility and is presumed to be the root cause of all that occurred. However, all evidence was destroyed along with the mansion, so further investigation has proven to be extremely difficult. What's this? Is that Jill in the front row? Sure is. Ooh, medicine. That'll help. Anything else? Ooh, storage box. I have no purpose for it, really. Oh, I don't need that. Uh, just randomly moving shit. Okay, I think I'm good, man. me to do now do I just leave and see what happens oh, there we go yeah what's up derail was anyone hurt Jill ah oh, shit wait what Jill Jill what happened Jill come in T I gotta go do what you gotta I'll take care of Bart Find a way above ground. Ooh, right into a save room.
Mine rounds? What the hell's a mine round? Ammo for a grenade launcher flies to its target using its own propulsion system, detonates after a short period of time. Interesting. Alright, let's go read that. New weaponry notice. Good news, limp dicks. I've got some new weaponry for you that's guaranteed to put the brass back in your sacks. Uh, they're called mine rounds. These babies were developed by Umbrella's military R&D and they will light your fires even hotter than the lover you left back home. God, this guy's... <laughs> they're tough to find and tricky to handle, but trust me, they're worth it. Alright, let's take a look at these specs. Mine rounds are designed for standard issue grenade launchers. Don't get cute and try to fire them on the wall and they'll stay right where you put them. The sensor in the mine will detect approaching enemies and detonate while you get within range. So basically just toss them in an enemy's path so you got yourself a landmine. There's no such thing as unfair when you're taking on those giant battles. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Cool. I got little proximity mines. Not sure if I need them yet, so I'll just keep my inventory open. Uh, God damn it. Uh, you motherfuckers. God, they're so good at staying away from my crosshair come on you got a very strange face for fuck's sakes <laughs> oh. no fuck you Items, cool. Oh, God damn it. bad okay I guess I go here oh seems like it's quiet and open he is going to show up ah random handgun ammo on a park bench Clock Tower brochure. St. Michael's Clock Tower. St. Michael's Clock Tower is a Baroque style building with which stands at the heart of Raccoon City. It's become a beloved icon and residents consider it to be emblematic of the city as a whole. St. Michael's Church erected this tower in 1908 with the assistance of several philanthropists. It was dedicated to the children born in the developing city and the first floor was used as an emergency school for many years. The city saw further growth during its elect electrification over the course of the 20th century and the student body of St. Michael's Elementary swelled to over 600 students. Unfortunately, St. Michael's Elementary was shuttered in 1978 as the building began to show signs of age and wear. The clock was deactivated and strict limitations were placed on entry to the surrounding premises. Years passed with this once beloved monument and public plaza on lockdown, but in the 1990s, the Umbrella Corporation worked in league with Mayor Michael Warren to renovate and reopen the area, this time with proper preservation efforts in place. The clock tower was officially reopened in 1993, and today the sound of its heavy tolling bells can be once again, can once again be heard throughout Raccoon City. There she is. I have a feeling we will hear those bells. 
get an herb. Do I have no nothing to switch to? Ah, fuck it. Uh, I have to. Wish there was a kick option like in Resident Evil 6. <laughs> oh, there's a little check. Point. Yeah, he's having a rough time. <laughs> Bitch can't swim. <laughs> Carlos, respond. Yeah, what's up? We didn't make it. The train derailed. Derailed? Was anyone hurt? No, everybody's dead. Mihail, everybody. Nikolai left us to die. Wait, what? What the fuck? Oh! Jill. Jill, what oh my god, what the fuck? How do I jump? Okay. No, oh, Jesus. It looks fucking awesome. What? What? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, God. What the f Oh, I do not have my proper weaponry. I needed my proximity shit. I'm definitely gonna die. Oh, what a dodge! Tried to fucking dodge that. Okay, I need to find something that can explode or otherwise incapacitate him. Which is probably why they told me about the goddamn mines. This is just a big open area. Uh, you motherfucker. Suck an egg. Reload! Ah, fucker. Ooh! Alright, I have ammo on this bad boy. Oh, maybe I should shoot at his limbs? Whoa, buddy. Probably where the proximity thing comes in handy. There we go. Ooh. Ah. Yes. Whoa, I got reflex time. Damn it. Oh, I thought I could time it again. Oh, come on. I dodged it. Yeah, no shit. I need to put a mine down when he's doing his jumpy deal.
Whoa. Are you? Ooh. I'm running low on ammo here. I'll just run. Let's just run. Okay, it's probably a lot easier when you have the fucking mine launcher. Alright, I'm just gonna load my last save. May come in handy too. Oh wait, I need the ammo. <laughs> uh, that's probably handy to have. Let's just go full stock, full flock stock. Yeah. Alright, and there's absolutely nothing worthwhile here, so let's just run right past all these idiots. Yes! Yes! Fuck off! Oh my god. Kinda looks like alien. Whoa! Whoa, 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 that's not cool. Oh my god, I think I'm dead. Oh, Jesus. Sorry, I'm quiet because I'm trying to focus on aiming on this son of a bitch! Ooh, buddy! Alright, that's done. Uh, left bumper. Come back around. Yeah, yo. Oh, wait, what's that little thing? What's that little thing hanging out of his chest? Yes. Oh shit, I hope I hit it. Come on. Oh, he's back at it, okay. Just gonna keep doing that. 
What even is that hanging out of his chest there? Alright, he's having a temper tantrum. Yeah, definitely needed this mine launcher crap. Holy crap, how much do I need to shoot into you? Doop, doop. Whoa, buddy. Whoa, buddy. Okay, he just ran right past me. Oh wait, now this is explosive rounds. That's not what I need. I need to pick up more mine rounds. I knew I found something here. Yes, thank you. I should probably take this time to try and get some ammo. Ooh, yes. Whoop. Yeah. Jesus Christ, how many times do we have to do this shit? Oh man. Just the same crap over and over again. Am I supposed to get him when he's like up there? Damn it. There we go. God, I'm low on ammo now. I don't need that. Anything here? Whoops. Oh, that was a waste. This is just getting annoying.
Ah, fuck beans. I got lazy. Got flame rounds ready. Hopefully he goes up to there. Oh no, it's gonna explode before. Ah, uh, motherfucker! Oh, I'm a fucking idiot. Probably take something for that. Come on, just fucking die! I have no more ammo. <laughs> Fuck's sakes. I don't have any more mines, so... It's too hard to hit while it's moving. Yeah, no shit. Oh, I have three bullets. I didn't have these bullets from this video that... <laughs> Was it just waiting for me to run out of all my bullets? Was that it? Carlos, you still there? Jesus. Oh, come on. You're gonna crap out on me now? God damn it. Oh my god. I have nothing. It's taking everything from me. Oh, there's ammo here. God damn it. <laughs> Guess I didn't search very well. Hopefully, say, oh, there's more mines. God damn it. Uh, there we go. What? Can we carry 20 to a friggin'? Gosh darn it. Uh, yeah, whatever. That's fine. Good night. Oh. 
Oh, that's fast. Oh, God. Oh, no. They need to get the antidote. You son of a bitch. Interest. You've done me a big thing. Miss. <laughs> Achievement. I don't feel so good. Roughly half a day later. Jill! Tyrell, do you copy? What's going on? Jill's been infected. I... I'm taking her to the hospital. Maybe Dr. Bard can save her. Alright, I'll meet you there. Really hope Tyrell doesn't... end up being one of the... evil people in the Umbrella the team you. here. looking at doors. Now we're in the hospital. Can I? Wait, does that use it on her or? Oh, I'm supposed to get the vaccine to use on her, right? Well, actually, maybe if I put my first aid. Damn it. It's not that easy. Alright, gonna save here. Well, that was exciting. Uh, Nemesis has turned into this <laughs> heavy metal demon thing. Oh man, that's pretty badass. It actually reminds me a lot of Alien. Uh, just more uh, external musculature that isn't just inky black. Um, yeah. Till the next one. Keep it spooky.